very warm welcome to St. Mary's Church this morning. Uh, a very uh, honoured welcome to my Deputy Lieutenant uh, Martin Stevens, our Mayor, and Deputy Mayor, and uh, members of our Town Council. And of course, members of our armed services, emergency services, and other uniformed organisations. You're all very welcome here this morning. <coughs> Father of mankind, forgive our foolish ways. Welcome everybody as we gather together as a town and community to remember those from Market Drayton who have fought in conflicts past, as well as remembering those we know who continue to serve their country. Let us remember before God those who have died for their country in war, especially those from this town, those whom we knew and whose memory we treasure along with all the unknown who have died in the service of mankind. They should grow no old as we that are left no old, 
Age shall not weary them, nor the years condemn. At the going down of the sun, and in the morning, we will remember them. We will remember them.
when you go home, tell them of us and say, for their tomorrow we gave our today. Thunderbirds, order standards! Will those playing wreaths please get ready to come to the front? <laughs> Deputy Lord Lieutenant Martin Stevens. Town Mayor, Councillor Roy Oldcroft, Market Drayton Town Council.
Czechoslovakian Air Force.
Responders. Mm -hmm. 
St. Mary's Lodge of the Freemasons, Market Drayton. Clive Lodge of the Freemasons Association, Market Drayton. Market Drayton Golf Club. Greenfields Association. Market Drayton Motocross Club. Is there anybody else wishing to lay a wreath? Please come forward. Market Drayton WI. Market Drayton Tigers Football Club. Join us arms. This one is unknown, but it means fun playing about. Well, the young lad wishing for the cross in, in memory of his grandfather. And that gentleman is the end of the replay. Thank you very much. Father of all, look with love on all your people, living and departed. On this day, we especially ask that you would hold forever all who have suffered during war, those who returned scarred by warfare, those who waited anxiously at home, and those who returned wounded and disillusioned, those who mourned, and those communities that were diminished and suffered loss. Remember too, those who acted with compassion, those who bravely risked their own lives for their comrades, and those who, in the aftermath of war, worked tirelessly for a more peaceful world. As you remember them, remember us, O Lord. Grant us peace in our time, and a longing for the day when people of every language, race, and nation will be brought into the unity of Christ's kingdom. This we ask in the name of the same Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen.
Loving God and Father of our Lord Jesus Christ, we now dedicate ourselves to serve you and all humankind for the cause of peace, for the bringing of justice, for the relief of need and suffering, and the praise of your holy name. Lord, strengthen our hearts, hands and minds to work together for peace, to see you in one another. kingdom above all things that your will may be done and your kingdom come through Jesus Christ the Lord of Lords and King of Kings Amen Almighty God the fountain of all goodness bless our sovereign Lord King Charles and all who are in authority under him that they may order all things in wisdom and equity righteousness and peace to the honor of your name and the good of your church and people through jesus christ our lord amen and so god grant to the living grace to the departed rest to the church the king the commonwealth and all people unity peace and concord and to us and all god's servants life everlasting and the blessing of god almighty the father son and holy spirit be upon you all now and always amen, amen. Rejoin the parade. Prince Hart! <laughs> 